week's tip is about whether or not you can deduct your vacation. If you are a self-employed person, then it is possible for you to use a strategy. You have to figure out a place that you'd like to go to where there is some business reason to visit. So is there a convention in Hawaii? Are there clients you need to see in Florida? If so, then you can deduct for the expenses of getting to that location. So getting to Florida, getting to Hawaii, and you do your business, you can stay an extra few days. The extra few days would be vacation. You don't write off the expenses of those days, but you got there for free. You got to that location by writing off the expenses of flying there. So it's, you know, it's kind of a win-win. You're getting some business done and you're also gonna get a little bit of vacation. The strategy here though, it ties into the saying you've heard a lot of times, I'm sure, that you know, pigs get fat but hogs get slaughtered. So you don't want to write off an entire two week vacation as a business trip. What you want to do is write off the travel to and from and some of the expenses while you're on vacation. If you're careful about that, you can make this strategy work for you. If you're an employee, maybe your employer will allow you to do the same thing. Get an extra few days while you're away uh, on vacation and you didn't pay to get there because it was a business write-off. Think about it. Planning can sometimes help you save a bunch of money. And that's this week's tip. Thank you.